hi everyone welcome back again to my channel i hope you all are doing great join me today as i show you an easy and an interesting way to make your chapati or roti without needing it and please watch this video till the end so without wasting much time i'm going to proceed now i'll go ahead to add one and a half cup of water into my large mixing bowl i will add salt and a spoon of sugar after that i'm going to mix everything together then i will proceed to adding my flour i'm going to gradually sieve in my flour into my large mixing bowl so after i'm done sieving in the first uh, portion of the flour i'm going to go ahead to mix with my whisk next i'm going to proceed to add the remaining flour then i'm going to continue mixing until i get a perfect batter for my roti and when mixing your batter make sure your batter is not too thick or too watery it should be moderate so next i'm going to place an empty dry pan on the heat spray some vegetable oil in it then i'll go ahead to use a kitchen towel to wipe it after that i'm going to use a soup spoon to scoop some butter into my pan then use the spoon to spread the butter and after that i will let it cook for a few minutes after a few minutes i'm going to flip my roti now while waiting for the roti to cook use your spatula to press down the edge of the roti next go ahead to flip it and continue pressing the edge down and cook until the roti starts to puff and once your roti bread starts puffing it means both the inside and outside of the roti they are well cooked you can go ahead to take it off the heat so guys repeat the same process with your remaining butter until you finish everything and please do support my channel by sending me super thanks or super sticker and also join my youtube membership to become part of this amazing family and also to see all my exclusive videos whenever i upload them guys i can assure you this is the simplest and the quick way to make your roti it doesn't require you needing your roti it will only take you uh, less than 10 minutes and you are done making your roti so finally i'm done making my roti bread now and don't forget to always cover your roti with a kitchen towel while making them to prevent them from getting dry so guys can you see how my roti came out they look so nice and delicious and please don't forget to subscribe to this channel if you haven't subscribed and also turn on your notification bell icon to be the first to get a notification whenever I drop a new video and also like and share this video. See you guys in my next video. Have a wonderful day.